What is up everybody? It's Moritz here from Section Store once again. Today we're going to be having a look at this typewriter section right here. It's an easy way to turn normal boring headlines into something more dynamic and more engaging. In this tutorial I'm going to do a little summarization of those four points and put it into this one right here and I'd say we just jump right into it. If you haven't done so already you have to get Section Store for the whole thing. It's a component library for Shopify exclusive only shops and that means if you got that whole thing you can easily in uninstall it as well afterwards so it's not gonna add unnecessary code to your Shopify store or anything so yeah I'd say that's a pretty good deal we are gonna install the whole thing and then jump into the Shopify admin area where we want to be looking for the app right here it's called section store and then we want to click on explore sections and like I said already the uh, app itself is completely free but we do offer a bunch of free sections in there as well but that one is gonna be free for the next day but after that it will be a one-time purchase of nine dollars so better be fast after that video got uploaded and yeah that's buy it right here or either download it and then head back to the home area and simply install it to your theme right there. It's called a streamline theme, but it works on every theme you're basically using. And if you run into any issues, always feel free to reach out to us. We're really happy to help you out and even set it up for you. Alrighty, after we've done so, we're gonna head to the online store and hit on customize right here. I've already done so, so I have it opened up. So that's the one you saw in the beginning of the video. I'm just gonna make that invisible and we're gonna start from scratch so we add the SS typewriter that's the one you saw already drag it at the same position as the other one and first thing we want to be doing is adding some text as you can see we want to add four points which the whole thing is actually improving it's gonna be sleep screen you're gonna see how it all works out in a second and dearest those are the things which are supposed to get protected so let's let it load up and it should appear right here perfect um, you can either leave the heading or not I'm gonna get rid of that so we don't need to adjust the heading size or anything I'm also not gonna need a second line it's just gonna use it like that is protecting your suite that's the lead up let's make that the same size change it to a different font that's something you can do here as well we want the mozara in bold that is looking good Let's select that. You can adjust the speed of the typewriter and how many seconds it should wait before it should change it again. Uh, the whole thing is changeable as well if you want it on the left side, the right side or the center. I'm gonna leave it on the, in the center. You can pick a border for the whole thing but I'm pretty happy with how it looks right now. I'm just gonna add some padding to the whole thing. As you can see basically everything in here is adjustable. So we're gonna pick the actual color of the thing and then the typewriter text color which is supposed to be a blue so it definitely stands out and the section background is supposed to be a very dark blue so maybe we wanna choose white for that one yeah that looks nice good contrast on that one and yeah I just say we save it all up and have a look at it in the live version which is gonna be that one that's the one you saw earlier and that is pretty much it in my case I would probably adjust the colors a little bit so the contrast is better but I think you got the whole concept of it I hope you guys found that useful and if you did always feel free to leave a like or a follow and with that being said have a good one guys and peace out